Ooh, it's Wendelius's journal. These people are far too superstitious for their own good. Gives me an idea. Maybe this place isn't really haunted then. We're here. Is that Lydia? Yay! I have a horse. Stop attacking my horse! What? Oh, no, no, no. No. Oh, there's more. Oh, no. Well, hello everybody, and welcome to the Daisy Space. I am so glad to be back, finally, after I unfortunately suffered a concussion the last couple of weeks, if you guys were wondering where I have been. I am feeling a lot better though, but today we are going to continue our Skyrim adventure. If you want to see all the types of shenanigans that we can get ourselves into, then make sure you stay tuned. Alrighty, so here we are back in our game. If you all remember last episode, we ended up finding a haunted dungeon. And as I rewatched it, I realized that I completely missed going in the room where we found the ghost because I basically ran out of there immediately. Oh no. That is a man. So I'm gonna go ahead and go back. Let's see. I don't even know which way it was. Ah! I already went in there. I remember that. Okay, next. Yep, this is a room I have not been in yet. <laughs> All right, let's see what we find in here. Ooh, it's Wendelius's journal. I also didn't realize that the ghost we were fighting was actually the man named Wendelius who the barkeep told us about. Some fella named Wendelius came through. Said he was some kind of a treasure hunter. I warned him not to go in there. Just like I warned you, the very next night we heard screams from the barrel, and that was it. We never saw him again. So you're telling me that there is treasure there? Interesting. The Journal of Windelia's Gathering. Ga gathering. I've set up camp inside the barrow. This has to be the place. According to all my research, the burial chambers should be located here. Oh, the burial chamber's probably behind that door that we couldn't get past. <laughs> All I need is some time undisturbed to find the claw. Does that mean the claw is like in the area? It must be hidden here somewhere. I had a close call today with that fool, Windhelm. He came close to entering the barrow, but I was able to scare him off by rattling some pottery shards in my bag. These people are far too superstitious for their own good. Gives me an idea. Maybe this place isn't really haunted then. After a few failures, I've come up with a mixture that should do the trick. The glow is perfect. I look exactly like one of the supposed spirits uh, the people of Irised believe is haunting this burrow. Going to test it out tomorrow. <laughs> so the guy tested like a ghostly serum that mean that's why we were able to kill him because he wasn't actually a ghost success it worked better than i could have imagined all i had to do was wander around about the entrance to the burrow at night and wave my arms around i had to stop myself from laughing aloud as they ran away this should keep them at bay while I continue to search for the claw. So if you guys remember last episode, when we walked into the dungeon, someone kept telling us to leave. Oh, that doesn't look leave pleasant. This place. Leave this place. What if I don't? <laughs> so apparently it was just Wendelius with his weird glow, glowing self trying to scare us away for his own game. Almost half a year has passed and no sign of the claw or any clues as to its whereabout. This is becoming maddening. It has to be here. Can't risk hiring any assistance, so I'll have to continue alone. It isn't here. It can't be here. It, this isn't right. It must be the people of Irested. They want to find the burial chamber on their own and keep riches for themselves. 
Why are they tormenting me? Why not destroy me? I'm... Who am I? My head is becoming clouded. I can't remember anything. I have to read my journal to remember any... To remember my purpose. Am I a part of this tomb? Am I meant to guard it? What is becoming of me? They shall not take my treasure. They shall all pay dearly for their crimes. Any who set foot in these walls will taste my wrath. My power. I am the guardian of the Shroud Hearth Barrow. All who oppose me will fall. Not today. <laughs> I'm gonna take your journal because it's cool. There's that potion he probably took to become a ghost. Money, 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 money. And a lockpick. So apparently he was not able to find the claw. Which makes me think it's probably not in here. Well, all right then. Money, money, money. I don't see any extra doors around here anywhere, so I think we're good to go ahead and head out. I think what I'm gonna do next is go find Lydia, because <laughs> we still don't know where she is. Yeah, it's been a pretty hectic two weeks for me. Just having the craziest things happen lately. I ended up getting a concussion because we got rear-ended and I hit my head. So last week, I was just like completely down. Uh, luckily, after week two, I finally feel semi-normal, hoping that I can continue getting chiropractic care and all that jazz. If you're wondering where I have been for the past two weeks, unfortunately, that has been where. <laughs> uh, but I'm excited to be back. I hope you guys are excited to have me back. I have some new ideas for some videos I'm excited about. I wanted to also let you guys know that this October, I am going to be doing a full month, once a week video starting the first Friday in October. We're going to be playing some spooky games, some haunted games, uh, to get ready for Halloween. So make sure you're here for that when that comes around. It's gonna be super fun. Okay, what do I need? I'm gonna go... Let's head on back to um, White Run and pick up Lydia. <laughs> We're here. Is that Lydia? Yeah! We heading out? Yes! As you will, my thing. We have been trying to head out this whole time. Actually, where do I even need to go? Houston Grav. I think I might go purchase a property since I have money. Mr. Yarl! Hello, Mr. Yarl. What is his actual name, by the way? May the gods watch over your battle. Another wanderer here to lick my father's boots. I'm gonna make you lick my boot. Where's the guy that I can buy things from? Maybe he's on the balcony. <laughs> Wow, your kids are lovely. <laughs> I found him. Sell me property. Splendid. There's a house available right now. Oh, I don't have enough. <laughs> Never mind. Maybe if I go sell stuff. Here, let's go. Let's go to Riverwood. Darn it! It's closed. I guess I can go spend the night somewhere. Ooh, the moon is pretty. Well, hello. What's a milk drinker like you doing out here? Go home to your mother. A milk drinker? Do you, are you like lactose intolerant What's or something? A milk drink need a room? Yes. Talk to Delphine. Oh. Who's Delphine? Where is Delphine? Hello. What's a milk drinker like you oh. doing out here? Hello. <laughs> You're that visitor been poking around. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Thanks. Mother. Hey, I rented a room. Don't make me hate you. Come on in, Lydia. Ah. I'm going to take a nap. It's eight. It's nine o'clock. So eight, nine, wait, nine, 10, 11, 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 10 hours. <laughs> I want to be awake whenever everyone else is out. A few moments later. You feel awakened and uh, refreshed. Poor Lydia just had to stand there while I slept. The Riverwood Trader. I wanted you to have this, a token of my affection. What? Don't mean we're engaged or nothing. Boots? Why would I think I was engaged if you gave me boots? The Riverwood Trader is 
Oh, a bit of this and a bit of that. I finally get to go through and sell half of this because I don't need it all. A troll skull, wow. Let's go ahead and travel to our next destination. All right, we're just gonna fast travel to the White Run Stables and that way we can be slightly close. You know, I might be able to purchase a horse. Where's the guy? Are you the guy? You're the guy. I'm the who? The guy. The guy from the poster. That guy. Gal like you needs a war. Suppose so. Got one all saddled if you've got the coin. Do I have the coin? You've got a deal. It's the one with the saddle. <laughs> really? <laughs> Yay! I have a horse. I'm sorry, Lydia. You're just gonna have to, like, run. <laughs> kind of feel like Lydia should be able to get up there with me, but... Oh, well. This may not take as long, I hope. Hopefully Lydia doesn't get lost. I'm riding a horse up the mountain. We're going to a place. Oh no. Oh no. How dare you! Wow, my horse is attacking him too! Ha ha ha! Good job, horsey. I like you. Oh, I forgot to search them! Take all your stuff. Onward! Let's do this. Uh, wait. Who's this lady? Are you okay? Lady? Oh, it's a lady who's dead! That's so sad! I'm sorry, lady! What did her note say? If you are reading this, then I am most likely dead. A group of bandits ransacked my home and took most of everything valuable in it. The worst is they took a pendant that has been my family for generations. Most of my family is dead, so that pendant was the last connection I had with them. I'm going after those scoundrels and getting my pendant back, even if it is the death of me. That poor lady. Did I have, did I find a pendant? Oh, I forgot this guy. Aha! Wait, I don't know. <laughs> don't know if I have the pendant or not. Onward! Whoa. I do not go off the cliff! Woohoo! Y'all remember last episode, you found out all about my run-ins with cliffs. <laughs> Actually, I'm pretty sure I fell off of that tower over there <laughs> and died. Okay. <laughs> Onward! Ah! Oh, oh. <laughs> I literally just went off a cliff! Hey look, an elk! Hello, Mr. Elk. Oh yeah, I did a cannonball off of that rock over there. <laughs> I want to jump in the water. Wait, I'm gonna go up higher. Cannonball! That wasn't as nice as I thought it would be. <laughs> Am I going the right way? I don't think I'm going the right way. <laughs> Gosh dang it. Okay, well, turning around. <laughs> oh, that also reminds me. I need to save. <laughs> horse can jump. Whee! Hey, it's raining. I think I could take a shortcut. Or is that a cliff? I don't know. Yeah, that's a cliff. Let's not go down there, horsey. If you've not checked out any of the other Skyrim videos, I would recommend to go check those out. They are super funny, full of excitement, so make sure you check them out. I will leave the clickable i button for that playlist over there. I'm gonna have to plug my computer in. Ah. Excuse the interruption. Don't look at me. I know I was already here. Okay, I'm going the right way now. <laughs> Man, don't you guys love thunderstorms? Like, they're just so relaxing. It's like the perfect time to just curl up in bed or on the couch and read a book. <sighs> it's also a nice time to take a nap. Do you guys enjoy thunderstorms? If so, why and what do you like to do during thunderstorms? Leave it in the comments below. If you don't like thunderstorms, what kind of weather is your guys' favorite? Also let me know in the comments below. Oh, there's a giant over there. 
Not doing that today. No, thank you. Hey, a mammoth. I'm on my way to collect something for the graybeards because they said so. Ah! I got it. What? There is someone hitting me with arrows. Who's doing that? Stop attacking my horse. How dare you attack a person on a horse? Are you okay, Mr. Horsey? Are you all right? He's just like, get away from me. Okay, onward. <laughs> Before we were rudely interrupted. Wow, there's some more. Hello. I know I can make a lot of money by killing those, but I'm not going to because they're harming nobody. I'm going to enjoy killing you. How dare you? <laughs> Just shot her in the head. Ooh, these are cool. Ooh, this is a pretty area. Ladies, Lady Rinania. What? Oh, no, no, no. Nope. Oh, there's more. Oh, no. I don't know what I'm doing. That's a cliff. Don't hit my horse. Oh, my horse is going after him. Uh, horsey, I want you out of here. Lydia. It's about time! <laughs> what is happening? This horse is probably like, I'm gonna die. <laughs> Whee! Ooh, I think I'm getting close! I found it! Houston Grab! Oh, people. Oh, no. Freeze my horse, woman! Are you okay, horsey? Thank you. I'm so sorry that you got hit. Don't die. Hi, Lydia. Welcome to the party. Alright, guys. Well, I think that will do it for this episode. So, if you guys enjoyed that, then make sure you leave a like before you go. And also make sure you comment below your thoughts. And if you're new here and you enjoy what you see, then make sure you hit the subscribe button down below. That way you don't miss out on any of my future videos and you will be here for our October where we are going to play some horror games throughout the month of October. So make sure you're here for that and subscribe below if you are interested. Keep in mind that the subscription is completely free and it helps me out get started here on YouTube. With that, I hope you guys have a blessed week and I will speak to you guys in my next video. Bye!